Now it's four o'clock. Still on Tuesday. I uh, just finished a um, video and uploaded it. Now I'm at a place called Rosie's Beach. I parked right there on the street. There is one of those signs that says uh, I'm too wide and too tall. But I think I can stay there. The reason I think I can stay there is because it's got PC plates and I'm not going to leave it very long. But this is a long beach, that's for sure. Have a look. As far as the eye can see in either direction, just one big major beach. It's such a huge beach, there's no footprints just uh, where the machinery have come by and cleaned it up. And since that happened, the wind has blown off all the crests. Only my footprints. Deeper beach today. It's not all that steep, but uh, the water, it's not as flat at the water's edge. So the water doesn't come in quite so far up the beach. This is one of those islands I was talking about that they tried to turn into or make look like a tropical island. It's interesting being here and seeing all these tankers and all of this kind of development because this is exactly the argument that's going on in my hometown about an oil pipeline and what the, uh, oops, the water's coming in, and what the, uh, tankers might do to our own community. The sun's going down, so I better get out there. Well, I'm tired. I'm leaning against the uh, volleyball post. I'm worn out. Too much walking around and driving around and stuff today. I like uh, a more sedentary life. Anyway, I'm going to turn the camera around to show you the sunset. So for me, life's a beach. For some, this sort of scene can only be seen daily by the people in those houses. Since I moved into the bus, scenes like this have been a daily occurrence. Don't say you're a lucky man. This happened by design. And you can do it too. Almost anybody could do this easily. Well, to be truthful, I also need to go to the bathroom. That happens every day, a bunch of times a day. So um, I need to find like a friendly place. <laughs> friendly meaning I can get something inexpensive and, uh, you know, feed myself. Well. This is just not quite what I'm looking for. Sounds good to me. Well, I'm disappointed. I thought I was going to see like rhubarb pie, a whole bunch of neat kinds of pies. But they got chicken pot pie and all that kind of stuff, like actual meal pies, and then a couple of other dessert pies. Well, it's a busy time of night, that's for sure. There I can. Then I found a taco store and later, after I ate, discovered one of my subscribers suggested this exact spot. You all the time. Yeah, and then uh, this so, controls the... Uh... No, it doesn't do anything. I take videos everywhere I go, so... You're going to see your taco shop in there. Right across from the uh, pie hole, which had a good, obviously had a good day, but didn't have what I wanted to eat. Well, I could have gone to the pie hole and got a dollar store, uh, what do you call it, pie plate, you know, one of those, uh, uh, the, the crust, the pie crust that you can buy in a doll, in, at least in that 99 cent store for 99 cents. And then that pumpkin out of a can popped onto it. That would have been my pie. Instead, I got three tacos for two bucks each. 
cheaper and I think it's a way better dinner. Get to dance to uh, the music from Wild Thing while I eat my taco. Well, kind of reminds me of what I would have felt like when I was 20. Except uh, I'm not 20, but I'm hungry. Wait a sec, there's one thing. One thing. One thing I forgot to mention. The pie hole is a great place to shit. Got a nice toilet. Hmm. These are good. Well, after a tough day of hanging out at the beach, a man gets pretty hungry. My friend in Venice Beach is going to be real happy to hear that there's a restaurant called the Pie Hole because he's, uh, he makes t-shirts and I think one of his t-shirts referred to a pie hole. So these were fish tacos. That's what the bus looks like at night and talk about luck. I just park the bus and I go where am I going to eat? So I go around the block and end up finding the pie hole. And then I come across the street and my favorite tacos are right there. Yeah. Pete's coffee and tea looks good. This is a pizza place. And here's some kids misbehaving. Well, I've never heard of this place, but it says it's been around since 66. And they sell outdoor gear. It looks like outdoor gear. Uh, they've got 360 degree or warmth. Um, they're selling in a place that doesn't ever get below 50 There's degrees. More tacos! I have too many taco stores. I'll make it. Right on time. I love these kind of things, the drawings, the murals that exist everywhere. Very cute little dude. Okay, I found a Starbucks. Now I can get some Wi-Fi and figure out where I am. This town is made for van dwellers. So I'm heading into Starbucks. It's Christmas at, Christmas at Starbucks. So I edited this video at Starbucks. I'm going to upload it here too. If this video helped you laugh or pick a place to eat, like the video and please think about subscribing.